Uh, today in Alabama, the fight over IVF in vitro fertilization is intensifying. Lawmakers introduced a bill that would protect the procedure as protesters took to the state capitol in a day of action, as they're calling it. Hundreds of people gathered outside the building to fight for IVF rights today. The state Supreme Court there ruled earlier this month that frozen embryos are legally considered children in that state. And as a result, several clinics have stopped offering services worried about their possible legal implications. One woman at the protest shared her journey with IVF so that she could help raise awareness. For us, this is deeply personal. If this ruling would have happened a month ago, I wouldn't be pregnant. I would be right there with the thousands of families stuck in limbo. The bill introduced by Alabama lawmakers yesterday would give civil and criminal immunity to doctors who provide IVF. There's also concern from some that other conservative states might follow in Alabama's footsteps. The White House says the best solution here would be for Congress to codify Roe versus Wade.